guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. It's the life of Stephanie. Okay, so basically today I am going to give you a tour around the mass communication library. And as you can see, I'm not with my tripod, I'm not with my um, ring light, so I look stressed out, sweaty and yeah. I had only one class today, so God is good. Anyways, so basically, like I said before, I'm going to give you a tour around the mass communication exquisite library. And yeah, just come along with me. And okay, so basically, this is when I got dressed for class. So just checking out myself, you know, it's not easy fam. So as usual, I had to take bike to where they call small gate or back gate this is literally me feeling all shy for no reason <laughs> yeah so this was roughly around um 9 40 something 9 50 something yeah because i had this morning class so i was just um walking down yeah then i saw my colleagues yeah those two at the front so i was walking down to class for the first time this semester yeah because there was kind of a confusion we we're thinking that we were supposed to have the class in um they call it weekend hall but there was another class that was meant to still hold in the mass communication hall so there was this confusion so we just decided to you know walk down and again keke at that point i heard that keke was 18 era though it's not expensive though but you know i just felt like not wasting money kind of <laughs> that's the two side of me talking no or should i say the agbero side anyway so we're still walking down and the sun has not yet come out so that's a good thing or the clouds cover the sun yeah that, i'll just say that so yeah that over there is the computer lab and the other side is the sandwich hall this is like a place where people wait and yeah i'm just still checking out myself you know it's not easy to be this breezy <laughs> feeling fly my lip gloss was falling off and i didn't know anyway it's all corrected still feeling good people were looking at me over what to do anyway um yeah we met some of our other colleagues catching up and still walking down to the mass communication hall i'm just showing you yeah that's um i think the new convo arena i don't really know if that's the building for it but it's been on for like i did pre degree so it's been on for like three years so this is um we're walking towards the faculty of social science but we've not yet gotten there yeah the sun is high it started spiking us okay so ladies and gentlemen welcome to the mass communication library yeah i just have some plates anyway so yeah this is the delta state university mass communication library as you can see there are a lot of different genera of shelf labels but yeah i'm just giving you a sneak peek around the library it's really beautiful actually if i do say so myself <laughs> yeah that's my seat um each um seat has a system yeah where you can research for different things and stuff like that so these are students that are reading they're actually my colleagues though yeah so um i feel like this is a static kind of shelving it's not really arranged in alphabetical order but it's arranged according to the genre yeah yeah i said genre because that's the British way of pronouncing it. It's G E N R E genera. Yeah. I don't really know if I'm pronouncing it well, but 
like that. It's just my tongue. So there are different categories of books. We have the one for broadcasting, the one for journalism, the one for advertising. We have different newspapers from different years. You can see 2005 and yeah, different years. The Guardian, Punch, Pointer. It depends on the years. There are a lot of magazines, yeah. It's really nice, it's really really nice. You can feed your eyes on them, research. There are a lot of research work. Vanguard, yeah. These are research works from different students that have passed on. We have materials from public relations to advertising to journals to broadcasting. And mind you, before you can have access to all of this divine glory <laughs> you have to get the library card yeah from me of course or the assistant librarian yeah that's just it i'm taking a sip of a drink so in case you hear that and yeah we have a photocopying machine in case you want to do any of those kinds of work we're here for you yeah, I'm just showing you guys everything. The chairs, the, the way it's spaced. It's not really meant for a crowded kind of um, group of people. It's just reserved and airy. It's really nice. Yeah. So this is like the outside. So anyway, um, you guys have seen it all and just taking a cool sip of some water. Don't forget guys, always, like always stay refreshed. Yeah, that's all I have to tell you. Always stay refreshed, always be hydrated because there's also stress if it gets into your head it can cause madness i said to god so mm. yeah and i like using a straw since i've not yet gotten all this fancy water bottles and the rest so yeah anyway most times most times i won't lie if i buy a table water a bottled water i tend to keep the bottle i not not just recycle i won't call it recycling i keep it then funny fact i buy the sachet water pure water <laughs> then i pour it inside later on you get so yeah the cycle continues mm. and with that just our little secret so the sun is sunning as you can see and I'm just enjoying my look for today. I look really serious today. Yeah. Not really serious though. I would just call it being sharp, kind of. Yeah. Though I didn't leave my edges, but I'm just tired. So, this is basically how I live my day. What did I just say? This is basically how I spend my time in school. Most times the, lab the assistant librarian comes, so we take um, we take turns. We have this um, timetable here. Okay, as you can see, this is for the librarian and this is for the assistant librarian. So we have this um, timetable where we're supposed to um, be in the office be in the library so yeah anyway I'm done with classes so I'll be here till 5 6 o'clock depends mm -hmm. students haven't come yet because today there are a lot of classes taking place some came around before but i can't really be doing this video while they are here because it will be distractions you know anyway so that's just it basically yeah 
And yeah, I got this um, Parago. Whoever remembers Parago. Yeah, I got this Parago. And the most shocking thing happened. When I opened it, I found out, yeah, I found out that it's the milk cone that is inside, but this is boldly written strawberry. So I'm wondering, I don't understand what I ordered versus what I got. Anyway. Mm. It still tastes like a strawberry flavor though. But I'm used to the color being pink. Anyway, I'm just ranting kind of because I don't really know what to say. I don't know. Yeah. That's just it. So I just felt like um looking a little bit pink, you know, trying to maintain some beauty. Don't allow what you're going through showing your face. So I just took my lip liner, yeah, and I'm just um applying it on my lips actually. Yeah. I don't really know what I'm doing but at least I'm trying yeah I'm trying this is just a while away time before I start doing my homework or should I say assignment yeah assignment sounds much more better so yeah I'm just trying to make my lips much more pronounced kind of i feel like it doesn't really last long but i still like the look yeah that's my eye pencil over there and next i'll be using the lip gloss yeah so i'm about to apply the lip gloss yeah all of this is just so I don't look like someone that's stressed out since I've been in class, walked under the sun, I'm already looking darkish ish kind of and yeah just applying the lip gloss and a little bit won't hurt so I just applied a little bit more and I think I over I, I, I added too much <laughs> but anyway it's still pretty yeah I removed some excess ones and yeah my face is back to life and I was just feeling fly so I got my glasses put them on and don't mind me oh, I'm just <laughs> giving you guys model vibes <laughs> So yeah, I'm feeling myself, you know, doing all the stuff that TikTok girls do. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so um, this is literally what one of the work that I was working on. Um, I just finished copying my notes and I was just trying to do my assignment. So that's just like a sneak peek of it yeah and here i am i love listening to music whenever i do my assignment or i'm trying to read or do most of the time if i'm reading it's a two by two something sometimes i use music sometimes i don't so at this point i'm doing my assignment with music yeah with the help of music it makes it much more easier so yeah, that's just it. So guys, that's it for my tour I gave you around the mass communication library. I am Ibrary Stephanie and it's the life of Stephanie baby. So yeah, have a nice life and don't forget, always be happy and don't forget to smile. Peace out, cause I'm out. <laughs>